What is up, my lacy lovers? Welcome to vlog day five. Oh, gee, five days in, you guys. That is super duper exciting. But do you know what is even more exciting? 50,000 subscribers! Bag it up, 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 I tell them bag it up, bag it down, bag it down, bag it up, bag it up, bag it up, bag it up, Let me give you another dance. Oh my goodness! You guys, you made 50,000 subscribers. I wanted it by Christmas. You gave it to me in four days of December. The fourth day of December, we hit 50,000 subscribers. Do you. I'm just gonna keep saying it because I don't think y'all understand like y'all are changing the game you're changing what you do for me and it's just awesome it is amazing I am thankful grateful just just so happy and just overwhelmed like I put a post up and I was like sometimes it gets overwhelming because it does like I half the time I don't even know what to say like I'm excited it's like I'll hit it and then I'll be like but the it's in my brain is like fireworks and cartwheels and backflips and I just don't know what to say but I am extremely grateful so thank you thank you thank you so I decided to hop on here for the fifth day of vlogmas and go ahead and do a Q&A to just answer some questions that everybody had we got over a hundred questions so I'm just gonna answer a few as many as I can get in the allotted amount of time but just know that I love you guys there will be more Q&A's like this so if you did not get in on this one just make sure the next time I post, whether it's on Instagram or on Snapchat, that you guys are following me on both so that you can get in on the next one, okay? Now, before we get into this video, you know what we gotta do, right? You know what we gotta do! We gotta do our countdown, you guys, from five to zero. When I get to zero, I need y'all to hit that thumbs up button. Are you ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Hit that thumbs up button! I love you guys thank you so much i love you i love you i love you if you hit that thumbs up button that means that you rock them and you love me that you 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 are right up for this lacy lovers and i am too so i love you and thank you for that make sure you are subscribing and turn it on those post notifications so that every single time i post you'll be notified and you'll be the first to comment so that you can get that shout out in the next video okay and then follow me on all of my social media platforms that will be right here at the top of the screen okay 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 okay, okay. we're gonna get into this Q&A so if you ready let's get it so first question is are you in a relationship absolutely not I am single as a dollar bill how old are the kids my daughter is seven years old and my son is five years old healthy strong and beautiful do you plan on getting married or having any more children yes I plan on getting married but it has to be to the right person I will not waste time again um, so yeah it has to definitely be to the right person and do I plan on having any more children absolutely I would like three more kids so physically I would like to have two kids and then I want to actually adopt my last child so in total I want five kids what is your favorite food I like pizza, french fries, chicken, and burgers, cheeseburgers. The next question is, have you ever had a fight? Yes, I've had a fight. Am I proud of it? No. Do I talk about it often? No. But I've been in numerous fights. I don't really like fighting. I'm more of a lover. But, you know, those fights, I was pretty much pushed to the edge. Everybody's asking, do I want more kids? Like, of course. I want this to be a whole squad over here. All right, so the next question is, how old are you? And how was it like having kids at a young age? 
Right now, I am 26. My birthday is in May, so in May, I'll be 27. How was it like having kids at a young age? It was challenging. I'm not gonna say hard, but it was challenging. So it was moments where, you know, things got really stressful for me, but I did it, you know, I just continued to pray and, you know, just ask that God bring me up out of everything that I was going on. If YouTube was to shut down for 90 days, what would you do? Now, YouTube is not the only revenue of money that I have, but it's, it's a chunk, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, if it shut down for 90 days, I wouldn't die. I would just be really penny pinching and just trying to like figure out what needed to go to what, but I'd be okay. Um, I'll just pray that YouTube does not shut down for 90 days because that's a whole, what, three months? No, we can't do that, but I'll be okay. I, I would survive. Have you ever whooped your kids? Now, when I think of a whooping, I mean that you are pulling out a belt and actually whooping your kids. Whipping, whooping, whatever you want to call it. And the answer is no. I've never hit my kids with a belt or a hanger or a switch. Now, they've got popped in the head or popped on the hands or something like that and told them to go to bed, but they've never gotten a whooping. I just not the way to go for me. Next question is what are your favorite holidays? So my favorite holiday is definitely Christmas. Now right after that would be Thanksgiving and um, Valentine's Day. I really like Valentine's Day even though I've been single for a very long time and haven't had a Valentine in a very long time. I love doing stuff for my kids on Valentine's Day. Like I get them teddy bears and chocolates. I take them out. We hang out together. So Valentine's Day for me is still good because I have my two babies. So we have a lot of fun. When were you born? That I was born in 1991. Were you full term with both children? Yes. My doctor would not deliver me until I hit the 39th week mark. And at 39 weeks, I, I, I could have actually kept going until, you know, my water bag broke. But, but with both kids at 39 weeks, I was up in there like, oh, I can't do it. Take the baby. So I, I had to get induced with both kids, like neither one of my water bag. My water bag did not break with either so the next question is, did it hurt when you gave birth? Mm, Kayla, no. I got an epidural and everything worked out. I had pushed her out and it was emotional. That was about it, but I didn't feel any pain. The pain didn't really kick in with Kayla until after I left the hospital because I did get a lot of stitches with her TMI, but I did. And they hurt really, 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 really bad. Um, and then with Kaysan, I felt the birth and then after I pushed him out, the epidural kicked in. So it hurt it while I was giving birth. Yes, my contra contraction. But after I gave birth, everything went away. What is your favorite childhood memory? And my favorite childhood memory would have to be when me and my family took family vacations. So once a year, and my mama kind of started this late, but it didn't matter. We took family vacations. So like we would go to Hawaii. We went to Virginia Beach. We went to West Wisconsin Dells like we did stuff like that and it was super fun those are my best childhood memories because I just love taking trips with my family we all packing up getting in the car getting all the snacks stopping along the way to go like those were my favorite childhood memories all right so another person asks how does it feel to be a famous youtuber now I don't think that I am famous um but I do have a lot of supporters at this point. Like 50,000 supporters is awesome. I love you guys so, so, so much. I don't feel any different from when I was at 100 subscribers. I feel the same. Um, I just feel like I'm at a higher number and I'm very grateful, very appreciative. So I wouldn't say that I'm famous or anything like that though, no. I do feel like I have a lot of supporters. I get love from you guys every day, whether it's in my DMs on Instagram or 
you're snapping me all day you're sending me love stuff like I love stuff like that so thank you what state do I live in I actually live in California I used to live in Illinois Chicago Illinois but I moved to California about four years ago someone asked how old were you when you had your first child I was 19 when I had my first child I had her in April I was turning 20 in May so I was 19 when I had her I got pregnant with her when I was 18 though. when did you start YouTube I started the channel maybe in 2013 but that was just to watch youtubers and have a Google account and stuff like that but I officially started YouTube February 26 of 2017 so this year I started in February so February 26 of 2018 marks my year mark of officially being a youtuber so yeah I'm so just excited for that date like I just want to see where I'll be at that date like when February 26 come around will I have my hundred thousand subs like I really want it by then I want to say that I made a hundred thousand subs in under a year so let's get it let's let's get on it tell your people tell your mama your daddy your auntie your uncle okay tell everybody all right and then my last question that I have is where is the kids dad the kids dad is actually still in Chicago and that's it that is the answer that everyone wanted to know so I'm gonna go ahead in this video right here I don't really have too much more to say on the subject but I'm gonna go ahead and end the video right here but it was really awesome answering all of these questions for you guys if you have any more questions the next time even before I even post anything on snapchat or Instagram make sure you're just sending me messages anyways just so that when I go back I can see them and I can answer your question in my next Q&A video I love you guys so much thank you for 50,000 subscribers I'm so proud of you guys I'm so happy are right, you guys so we're gonna go ahead and get up out of here and end this video but I need you to go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up okay and then do not forget to subscribe and turn those post notifications on so that you can get the shout out in the next video okay also follow me on all of my social media networks they'll be right here at the top of the screen now before we get out of here I do want to give the post notification shout out to Amisha Benson so you were the first to comment under the last video so thank you so much for being a part of the notification squad thank you so much I love you so much kisses from me to you now, the lovely shout out will go to Tashara Sands. She said, oh my God, you guys are the best and you guys make me want to start my own personal channel. Thank you guys. Found you being there when I'm sad and happy. So I'm so happy that I could be there for you when you're down and then when you watch my videos you feel better. So I love you, I love you, I love you and thank you for always being there and just being supportive. Um, whatever you're going through you can always message me on whatever platform okay and then just talk to me and I'll talk back to you guys okay. But I do love you and we're going to go ahead and get up out of here hunting. And as 